So Gaffer, a 1-0 win tonight against uh, Dagenham, enjoyable? Yeah, I enjoyed it. You know, he's a bit uh, airy at the end with a few of the, you know, the longer balls into the box and things like that. We had to defend uh, a lot of crosses and things put in there, but they, they stood up to it. I thought for a young, a young back five, it was uh, a great, great effort to, to keep it at nil. And uh, I'd say two clean sheets, delighted with it. Absolutely delighted. If you go back to, to Saturday, obviously there wasn't much time to prepare for, for tonight's fixture. So what was the, the thinking behind the starting eleven this evening? Well, um, Dates was a doubt before the game. We wasn't sure whether he'd be fit with his ankle. He, 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 had, he had quite a bit of bruising on his, on his foot, um, but he declared himself fit this morning after a fitness test. Um, so we brought him back in. We originally, we planned without him, but we brought him back in. And uh, going with him and Bocco just gave us a little bit more attacking threat, I thought. Uh, we could have gone up with two midfield players in, in those positions, but it would have given us you know, less options in terms of uh, being creative and attacking. So playing that little two in behind the two up front, um, very difficult to mark uh, how they play. And um, the deep one just gives us a little bit of cover when teams leave a couple up. You know, the three centre halves have a little bit of cover in front of them. And, and at the moment, it seems to be okay. I say, you know, Judy and uh, Caprice are showing that they can be really good wing backs. Um, you know, he goes up the pitch very quickly. Judy, you know, he's, he's a little bit of his quality at the end, but um, you know, defensively, he's very solid um, and probably defends better than Jake. But Jake attacks better than Judy, so it's a nice little balance there.